this is Miss Kelly here, and today you're exploring all about habitat. Whether that's a nice big forest, a cool lake, or a sandy beach, there are habitats everywhere. One great habitat you can explore in your own backyard, neighborhood, or even at Blue Jay or other parks are logs. They are great small habitats for lots of creatures. So today we're going to read a story called Log Hotel by Anne Schreiber to explore a little bit more about logs and who lives there. Log Hotel by Anne Schreiber. This oak tree has been living in the forest for a hundred years. One day, a strong wind knocks the tree down. The tree falls to the ground. Now the tree is a log. Soon, ants and beetles move in and eat the log. They drill small tunnels in the log as they eat. The tunnels help to make the log soft as it decays. This woodpecker is listening for bugs inside the log. As soon as it hears a bug, it drills through the bark to catch it. Tap, tap, tap. Soon, living things called fungi grow on the log. Inside the log, fungi look like spaghetti. Outside the log, fungi look like mushrooms. Snails and slugs move in. They creep through the tunnels as they hunt for fresh fungi and dead beetles and ants to eat. The tunnels get bigger, the log gets softer. A snake slithers through the log. It is looking for a place to rest for the winter. Soft moss grows on the log. Green ferns grow in and around the log. This log is like a plant, an animal hotel. As time goes on, more and more plants and animals move in. The log gets softer and softer. Now the shape of the log is hard to see. Earthworms eat what is left of the log. The earthworms turn what they eat into soil. The soil is a perfect place for a seed to grow. The seed will grow into a tree. One day the tree will fall. It too will become a log hotel. So I hope you all enjoyed listening to Log Hotel by Ann Shriver and that you have a chance to get out today or maybe you already have to explore what lives in logs. Maybe you found some little insects. Maybe you found a neat reptile. Maybe you heard a woodpecker tap, 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 tapping away looking for insects. Or maybe there's a squirrel running away with an acorn to plant in a new place for a new tree to grow. We can't wait to hear about what exciting things you found underneath logs or in logs when we see you next.